It's time to copy and paste. Let's get into it. Hey guys, how y'all doing out there? It's time for another tutorial from Pinnacle Studio Pro. I know most of y'all already know the simple way to copy and paste things. But I know some things you don't know. And I'm going to show them to you right now. Let's start off with the basic way to copy and paste. The basic way is you just left click on any one of these clips to activate it. And then you can either do control C to copy it. Or you can right click on the clip and go to copy. Place your playhead where you like to put the new clip. And you can do control V. Or you can right click and do paste. Now, this is the easy way to copy and paste, but there's a few problems with it. When you copy and paste like this, you can only paste it into the same timeline track. Now, of course, you can drag it to the other track afterwards if you want to, you know, but you know me, I like to, you know, put a little flair on things. So I'm going to show you a different way to copy it and paste it to whatever track you want. All you really got to do is left click to activate it. Hold down the control key on your keyboard and hold down your left mouse. Now, if you drag it away from there, you're creating another copy and you can put it on whatever track you want to and then let go of control and the left mouse at the same time and boom. So you do it all at once. You don't got to copy it to paste it to the same track. You just go ahead and put it wherever you want. Beautiful. I love that. Okay. So now let's talk about copying and pasting multiple clips. So if you click anywhere on a empty timeline track, hold your left mouse down and drag the little white square that you're creating over the clips, you will activate more than one clip at once. Now, once again, you can do control C, Put your playhead where you want and then do control V to paste it. It'll all stay on the same track. Or you can hold down the control key, hold down your left mouse, and drag the whole set of clips to wherever you want them to go. Now, one thing that you got to know too about copying and pasting is you got to know what your timeline settings are on. Right now, I have mine on overwrite mode. What that means is that wherever I put it, everything else will stay in place. Nothing else will move around. I could put this here, nothing moves. But if I change this to the smart timeline and I start moving stuff around, you'll see stuff starts jumping all over the place. So if you don't want it to do that, make sure that you have it in overwrite mode. Also, insert mode, if you go to insert mode, it'll make stuff jump around because you're telling it, I want to insert this and move everything else over. So make sure that you have it in overwrite mode if you don't want things moving around. All right, so let's talk about another type of copying and pasting that you can do. And this one is with effects. Anytime you see a pink line at the top of one of your clips, this means that there is an effect applied to it. It could be an audio effect, it could be any kind of effect, it doesn't matter. But that pink line means there's an effect. So if I hover over that pink line with my mouse or my cursor, you'll see the little FX show up. Now when I see that little FX, I know that my cursor is over the pink line, so I can right click on it, go to effect, I could do copy all. I can left click on a clip that does not have an effect on it. I can right click it and do paste, or I could do control V and it will paste the effect to that clip. That's it. Copying and pasting in Pinnacle Studio 17 Ultimate. Now, you guys know the routine. The thumb. 
the one that's pointed in the upward direction. Click it, like it, live it, love it, hug it. Show the thumb some love. Comments. You know I love comments. I love comments more than anything except my wife, my kids, my family, my friends, my savior. Well, hell, there's a whole lot of things that I, that I love more than comments. But I love comments, all right? So, if you leave me a comment, I'll do my best to help you. If I can't help you, I'll point you in the right direction to get you the help that you deserve. And last, but definitely not least, don't you ever forget to... Subscribe, baby. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.